Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Naima and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make African beanie. I believe in English it's called African donuts, but if I'm wrong, let me know in the comment section down below how you call African beignet in English. Without further ado, let's get started. First thing first, I'm going to show you the ingredients you need to make this recipe. So you're going to need wheat flour, white sugar, some salt, one dry yeast bag, you can also use fresh yeast if you don't have dry yeast, you're also going to need vanilla sugar, and last but not least, warm water. Now I'm going to make the dough. So in a container I'm going to add 500 grams of wheat flour. I'm going to scatter the flour with my hand and add one bag of dry yeast. Next, I'm adding 150 grams of white sugar, two bags of vanilla sugar, and one and a half teaspoon of salt. And mix everything together with my hand. Guys, make sure that your hands are extremely clean before you start this recipe. When I finish to mix the flour with the other ingredients, I'm going to add 700 ml of warm water gradually and now the work begins. Yes guys, you're going to knead the dough with your hands for about 15 minutes until the dough becomes smooth and homogeneous. This recipe is simple and delicious and it comes from Africa, especially Sub-Saharan Africa. When you start to see bubbles like those in the dough, that means that the dough is well kneaded and also it means that the fermentation starts and the dough is going to rise. The dough is well kneaded and I'm going to cover my container with a plastic lid, but you can also cover your container with some aluminium foil. And I'm going to let the dough rise in the oven because it's a warm place and also because the dough will rise faster. Make sure that your oven is off. After 2 hours in the oven, I'm going to remove the dough.
and as you can see the dough has doubled in size. Now I'm going to fry my African beignet. So I'm going to turn on the stove on high heat and I'm going to add oil in my pan. When the oil is hot, I'm going to add my dough with my hand in a bowl form. For those who may not know, African donuts are widely used in the street food in the majority of black African countries. Depending on the country, they are called Botokwe in Togo, Puf Puf in Nigeria and Cameroon, Mikate in Congo, and Bofloto in Ivory Coast and Ghana. When the beignet become golden, I'm going to turn to the other side and let them cook till it become golden. So when they are golden, I'm going to remove them with a skimmer and put them in a dish. But before you put them in a dish, add some paper towel in the dish so that when you add the beignet, the oil from the beignet is going to be absorbed. And that is basically it for this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to leave a like and also comment down below if you have some questions. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye!